the new year brings several new cruise ships from a variety of cruise lines. There are also many ships that set sail in late 2022. So if you're thinking about a cruise vacation this year, then this video is for you as we have our list of the best new cruise ships you can sail on in 2023 up next. Welcome aboard, cruisers. I'm Don B from Eat Sleep Cruise, where we help you plan the perfect cruise so you can see the world one port at a time. And it's 2023, which means there are a ton of brand new cruise ships slated to be released this year. From some brand new designs to sister ships, we have our look at the best cruise ships that you can sail on in the new year. Of course, if we missed any of your picks for the best new cruise ships, let us know in the comments section below. And we're going to start our list with the third vessel in a brand new cruise line. Virgin Voyages is making waves in the cruise industry. After the successful launch of the adults only Scarlet Lady and Valiant Lady, the new cruise line plans to debut two additional ships. Resilient Lady will launch in 2023, followed shortly after by Brilliant Lady in 2024. Resilient Lady will embark on her mermaiden voyage on May 14th, 2023 on a round-trip Greek Isles voyage. During the summer season, the ship will sail two unique itineraries, the Greek Island Glow and the Adriatic Sea in Greek Gems. Resilient Lady will then depart on a 44-night repositioning voyage, heading down under for a winter season in Australia and New Zealand. Perhaps one of the most appealing aspects of Virgin Voyages is its all-inclusive nature. Cruise fares include all dining, all gratuities, basic Wi-Fi, and group fitness classes. Of course, the other big draw for many cruisers is that there are no kids. We've sailed both on Scarlet Lady and Valiant Lady twice now, and we really enjoy certain aspects of the Virgin cruise experience. We love the laid-back vibe, including the aft located dock, which features great cocktails and small bites. We also really enjoy the variety of dining options. From Mexican to Italian to an upscale steakhouse and a Korean barbecue, there's so much diversity. Not to mention, the food is hands down the best at sea. Virgin Voyages also features some of the most unique cabins at sea, complete with a terrace hammock. That's right, you can actually relax on your balcony in a hammock. Why hasn't the cruise industry thought of this sooner? Further, if you're looking for something a bit different when it comes to entertainment, Virgin Voyages delivers. The signature productions found across all the ships include Dual Reality and Untitled Dance Show Party Thing. Both shows are very different, but equally entertaining. If you follow along with our travels, then you know we've recently sailed on Norwegian Cruise Line's newest cruise ship, Norwegian Prima. As NCL's first new class of ship in nearly 10 years, Norwegian Prima succeeded in delivering a completely fresh take on cruising. And what's better than one ship? Well. Two ships. Prima's sister ship, Norwegian Viva, is debuting in 2023. Norwegian Viva will set sail in August from Italy, visiting ports of call in the Mediterranean, before making her way to the United States. Here, she will sail the Caribbean from San Juan, Puerto Rico. Norwegian Viva will feature many of the same amenities and design elements as Norwegian Prima. Boasting upscale staterooms and public venues, the Prima class ships are certainly more elegant than other ships in the NCL fleet. With NCL's signature freestyle approach to dining, cruisers have the option to dine in the newly transformed main dining rooms, one of the many specialty restaurants, or the new Indulge Food Hall. Personally, we love the Indulge Food Hall, which shows up a variety of quick service options. You'll also find new bars with signature cocktails like the Belvedere Bar and the sustainable Metropolitan Bar. When it comes to onboard experiences, there's no shortage of things to do on Norwegian Viva. From the Viva Speedway and the drop slide for thrill seekers, to the elevated Mandera Spa and Thermal Suite for those looking to relax, there's something for everyone. Perhaps the most stunning addition to the Prima class ships though, is the Ocean Boulevard. The Steck 8 waterfront now offers double the space and a greater variety of experiences and dining options. The new Ocean Boulevard is 44,000 square feet long and wraps around the entire deck. The area features several unique spaces like the concourse with a brilliant outdoor sculpture garden and Infinity Beach. Infinity Beach features 
two infinity pools designed to get guests closer to the ocean than ever before. America's favorite cruise line, Carnival Cruise Line, also has another new ship debuting at the end of 2023. Carnival Jubilee will set sail from Galveston, Texas for the first time in December of this year. If you can't wait that long to hop on board, Carnival Celebration recently set sail from the new Terminal F in Miami, Florida. Both of these ships are sister ships to Carnival Mardi Gras. Carnival Jubilee will sail the Western Caribbean, visiting ports like Mahogany Bay, Cozumel, and Costa Maya. As the newest ships in the Excel class, Carnival Jubilee will share many of the same features as her sisters, including the Bolt roller coaster. The cruise line has also hinted that the ship will feature a few unique experiences, zones, and signature venues of her own. We're thinking there'll be replacements for the 820 Biscay and the Gateway Zones that are now on Carnival Celebration. When it comes to dining, Carnival always delivers with its quick service venues. So you'll be sure to find Carnival staples like Guy's Burger Joint, the Blue Iguana Cantina, and Shaq's Big Chicken. Chibang, Cucina del Capitano, Guy's Pig and Anchor, Fernand 555, Bonsai Sushi and Teppiyaki, and Rudy Seagrill will also return on Carnival Jubilee. Where there's food, there's also drinks. You don't have to go far to find your favorite poolside cocktail at the two-story Red Frog Tiki Bar. There are also favorites like Guy's Pig and Anchor Brew House, Piano Bar 88, The Havana Bar, and Heroes Tribute Lounge. Additionally, Adults will love the Serenity Retreat Forward on Deck 18, while kids will love the Ultimate Playground, complete with mini golf, water slides, and a ropes course. For entertainment, guests can enjoy Playlist Productions in both the main theater and on center stage in the three-story atrium, as well as the signature Family Feud Live game shows. Not to mention, the Fun Squad hosts some of the liveliest pool parties and activities at sea. If a fun ship doesn't really appeal to you, then you'll love the luxurious resort vibes on Celebrity Ascent. As the fourth ship in Celebrity Cruises Edge class, Celebrity Ascent will debut in December 2023 as well. As the newest sister to the beautiful Celebrity Beyond, this vessel will feature most of the same amenities, venues, and experiences. When Celebrity Ascent debuts, she will sail the Caribbean from Fort Lauderdale for the winter season. She will then head to Europe in summer of 2024. While part of the Edge class, Celebrity Ascent and Celebrity Beyond have a few unique features of their own, as well as elevated design and decor. Perhaps the most stunning transformation is the Sunset Bar. This two-story space has been completely reimagined. With a Moroccan-style vibe, comfy furniture, a new signature menu, great views, and live music in the evenings. Also new to Celebrity Ascent and beyond, it's a specialty restaurant, Le Voyage. This restaurant, created by chef Daniel Baloud, is inspired by travel and showcases global cuisine. With an intimate atmosphere and upscale menu selections, this venue is a great addition to the Celebrity Cruises fleet. In terms of other bars and restaurants, frequent Celebrity Cruises will be happy to know that they can still find the Martini Bar in the Grand Plaza Cafe Albacio, Five Cut Steakhouse, Le Petit Chef, and more. The World Class Bar and Craft Social also make a return on this vessel. Like all Edge Class vessels, Celebrity Scent will feature four complimentary main dining rooms. These dining rooms offer a rotational menu, as well as a few exclusive dishes at each venue, giving cruisers plenty of options. When it comes to entertainment, Celebrity Ascent will surely include signature productions in the main theater, Eden, and the club, just like her sister ships. Add all the dining, bars, and entertainment options to some of the most luxurious staterooms at sea, Celebrity Ascent is certainly one of the best new cruise ships for 2023. MSC Cruises' newest ship, MSC Seascape, just debuted in Miami, Florida at the end of 2022. We were lucky enough to hop on a recent Caribbean sailing on the ship, and you should too. MSC Seascape is the fourth ship in the popular seaside class of ships. 
and the second Evo subclass. This evolution means that MSC Seascape is larger, offering more cabins, an expanded yacht club, more outdoor spaces, and a variety of dining and entertainment options. In keeping with MSC design, there's plenty of glitz and glamour on Seascape. The ship is adorned with metallic finishes and Swarovski crystal stairs. There's also the stunning Bridge of Size, a glass floored bridge over 70 feet above the infinity pool, which makes for a great photo op. Further, you'll find signature Italian touches throughout the ship, like multiple gelato shops and espresso served at every bar. Not to mention there's the Venki chocolate bar, serving up amazing alcoholic and non-alcoholic chocolate infused coffee and cocktails. Although the only problem is that's not included in any of the MSC drink packages. MSC Seascape delivers on bringing guests closer to the sea, offering a waterfront promenade and the beautiful infinity pool. The adults only space at the aft of the ship offers great wake views. Further, the kids are sure to love the exquisitely themed jungle pool. This pool has a retractable roof, meaning it's a pool day no matter the weather outside. Of course, there's also the marina pool, which has a more traditional Lido deck vibe. If you're a thrill seeker, you'll love the VR attractions in the Hall Games and the signature Robotron. This robotic arm, 170 feet above sea level, delivers the thrills of a roller coaster at sea set to your favorite music. There's also expanded offerings for kids and teens, including interactive game shows and partnerships with brands like Lego, making MSC Seascape a worthy choice for all ages. MSC Seascape offers delicious specialty dining options too, from the butcher's cut steakhouse to the casual Ola tacos, to Kato Teppanyaki and the Ocean Key Seafood Restaurant. There's cuisine to suit all palates. Not to mention, there's even a sushi conveyor belt at Kato Sushi. As the fastest growing brand, MSC Cruises just debuted another new ship as well, MSC World Europa. This ship is the company's most innovative and most environmentally advanced ship to date. It's the first ship in the world class of ships. Its sister ship, World America, is scheduled to sail from the US in 2025. Currently, World Europa is sailing from Dubai and Doha, but the ship will head to the Mediterranean this summer. Thus, 2023 is a perfect time to test out this new ship. With a variety of embarkation ports, the itineraries will visit popular ports in Spain, Italy, and France. MSC World Europa is designed to elevate the cruise experience and compete with mega ships from other cruise lines. With features like the Venom Drop, the new longest dry slide at sea, the largest water park in the fleet, bumper cars, an onboard microbrewery, new restaurant concepts, and more balcony state rooms than any other ship, we can't wait to check it out. Of course, cruisers will also find familiar favorites like the Butcher's Cut and Kato Teppanyaki specialty restaurants. The ship has seven swimming pools, an expansive indoor promenade with an interactive LED dome ceiling, the Hall of Games, and signature entertainment venues like the Panorama Lounge. The Coffee Uporium certainly has us intrigued. This venue offers a customizable coffee experience along with cafe seating indoors and outdoors. Not to mention, it also serves espresso martinis in the evenings. For even more variety, there's a new tea house, the Masters at Sea Pub with craft beer, the Gin Project, and the Elixir Mixology Bar. There's also a Zest Juice Bar and Sweet Temptations for gelato and soft serve. When it comes to dining options, we're happy to see more variety, including the new Luna Park Pizza and Burger. There are also two new specialty dining concepts, Chef's Garden Kitchen and La Pascaderia. For entertainment, World Europa features the multi-purpose Luna Park Arena, the World Theater, and the Panorama Lounge. Across these venues, guests can enjoy concert-style shows, five new signature productions, and other themed experiences. If you're looking for another European cruise option, MSC Euribia, a Mervilia Plus class ship, is also debuting in 2023. 
while not technically a new cruise ship for 2023, Costa Viencia will join the Carnival Cruise Line fleet. Selling from New York beginning in June, Carnival Viencia will offer signature Carnival Fun Italian style, blending the Carnival Cruise Line experience that guests love with exclusive Costa elements. This ship will bring something unique to the cruise market. Built in 2019 and set to undergo enhancements before entering service, Carnival Viencia will be home to many of the activities and experiences guests enjoy on board other Carnival ships. These include popular restaurants and bars like Piano Bar 88, Heroes Tribute Bar, Fahrenheit 555 Steakhouse, Bonsai Sushi and Teppanyaki, Pizzeria Del Capitano, and the Seafood Shack. Guests can also enjoy the Cloud Nine Spa, the Serenity Adult Only Retreat, and Carnival Waterworks. When guests board Carnival Viencia, they will be surrounded by Italian architecture in the atrium, which is modeled after Venice's famed Piazza San Marco. One of the main dining rooms will even include a real life Venetian gondola. The ship's outdoor spaces feature Italian touches as well, including a Lido deck modeled after the Italian Riviera. This pool features a retractable roof, so it can still be enjoyed when in New York during colder months. Some new touches include a new bar in Serenity featuring Spritz, Tomodoro with Mexican Italian fusion creations, grilled Italian street food, and sandwiches at La Strada Grill, a new specialty Italian restaurant and a variety of new bars with Italian-inspired cocktails and decor. Further, Carnival Viencia will introduce new Terraza staterooms. These staterooms are similar to the Havana staterooms on other ships. They will offer exclusive access to Terraza Carnival, an outdoor terrace deck. This deck will also feature two whirlpools and plenty of lounge space. Further, Terraza guests will also enjoy additional parks like a lounge with continental breakfast items, a special sea day brunch, and exclusive sail away event. In addition, some signature carnival venues will feature Italian touches. For instance, Java Blue Cafe will offer gelato. The menu at Guy's Burger Joint will include a pepperoni pizza burger and the Big Ma's, a burger smothered in melted mozzarella cheese. As the first ship, and Oceana Cruises new Alora class, Oceana Vista will debut in spring of 2023, sailing to iconic destinations including Rome, Athens, Istanbul, Barcelona, London, and more. This is certainly one of the best new cruise ships for 2023. Following a transatlantic in September, the ship will sail from Miami for the winter 2023-24 season visiting tropical locales. Oceana Vista is a 67,000 gross ton ship that carries 1,200 guests. Vista will mark the seventh ship in the Oceana fleet, meticulously designed to create a small ship luxury cruise experience. Oceana Vista will feature a number of inviting spaces, restaurants, bars, and experiences. A reimagined martinis bar an upscale and tranquil pool deck, a state-of-the-art Aquamar Spa and Vitality Center, a library exclusively styled in Ralph Lauren home, and culinary excellence across 12 dining options can all be found on board this new ship. It starts with the Grand Dining Room. This venue is inspired by the early 20th century Paris and features a globally inspired menu, including Jacques Pepin classics. Further, Ember is a new addition to the dining lineup. This restaurant will feature an American menu with dishes like short ribs, crab cakes, swordfish, and more. Aquamar Kitchen offers healthier options like pressed juices, smoothies, power bowls, and salmon, to name a few. Previous Oceana cruises will be happy to hear that Palo Grill, Toscana, and Red Ginger can also be found on this new ship. Not to mention, there's also baristas and the new nearby bakery. You won't go thirsty on Oceana Vista either, as the ship's debuting a new mixology program. Inspired by the latest cocktail trends, cruisers can now savor low and no sugar wines and zero-proof cocktails. 
There are also Negronis, Asian wooden barrels, and specialty beverage carts like the Bubbly Bar and Ultimate Bloody Mary Bar. Many of the restaurants will also feature signature cocktails to pair with the menu offerings. The staterooms too are an upgrade from contemporary cruise lines. They boast new standards for comfort and luxury, all veranda cabins, and new concierge level veranda staterooms just for solo travelers. Further, the standard staterooms on Vista are the most spacious at sea, measuring in at over 290 square feet. If you enjoy exploring the world in comfort, the Viking Saturn should rank at the top of your list for best cruise ships for 2023. The newest Viking Ocean cruise ship will debut in spring of 2023. As the ninth ship in the Ocean Fleet, Viking Saturn is nearly identical to her sister ships. With just 930 passengers, these 47.8 thousand gross ton ships visit a variety of destinations across the globe. Vikings focus on the destination-driven itineraries that complement the unparalleled service and inclusive nature of the cruise line. Thus, Viking Saturn will spend her maiden season sailing Northern Europe, including new Nordic voyages, visiting ports in Iceland, Greenland, Norway, and more. Viking Ocean ships boast state-of-the-art technology and all veranda staterooms. On a Viking Ocean cruise, you can also enjoy a free tour in each port of call. Wi-Fi, no up charges for specialty dining, and complimentary room service. Additional inclusions are beer, wine, and soft drink at meals, specialty coffees and bottled water, and access to the thermal suite. Further, Viking Ocean ships offer several dining options. In our opinion, it's some of the best food at sea. If you're looking for a casual atmosphere, the World Cafe offers buffet-style meals, including a sushi and seafood bar, with indoor seating or al fresco seating with the Aquavit Terrace. Guests can also enjoy Mamsons, a gourmet Scandinavian deli, and afternoon tea in the Winter Garden. For a more gourmet meal, Viking Saturn has a main dining room, the restaurant, Manfredi's Italian restaurant, and a chef's table. Here you can enjoy delicious multi-course meals with upscale menu selections that are all part of the cruise fare. While you're not enjoying your ports of call, you can relax in the thermal suite, which even features a snow grotto. Or you can admire the views from the cantilevered infinity pool. There's also a main pool with a retractable roof, meaning it's always a pool day. Perhaps you might choose to enjoy a performance in the theater or dance the night away at Torshaven. You can also sip a drink in good company in the Explorer's Lounge while admiring the Scandinavian design or simply relax in tranquil winter garden. If you're looking for some cultural enrichment, Viking features resident historians, guest lecturers, and even destination performances. For even more luxurious cruise options, in 2023, MSC Group is unveiling a brand new cruise line, Explorer Journeys. The first of six ships for this new cruise line, Explorer One, will set sail in July. The ship's maiden voyage will be a 15-night cruise from Southampton, England, to Northern Europe and the Arctic Circle. Explorer One will also make her debut in the Caribbean this fall. The 64,000 gross ton, all sweet ship will emulate boutique hotel vibes. The ship will feature a variety of stateroom options, ranging from the Ocean Terrace category at 377 square feet, all the way to the owner's residence, measuring at 3,014 square feet each with its own private terrace. It will also boast four heated pools, a variety of restaurants and bars, and a plethora of wellness offerings. Explorer One will be home to six distinct restaurants, as well as in-suite dining and 12 bars and lounges. Anthology will offer global cuisine with specialties from guest chefs, unique wine pairings, and more. Sakura will feature a pan-Asian cuisine while Marble & Company Grill is your European steakhouse at sea, and Phil Rouge is an intimate French restaurant. Further, the Med Yacht Club is reminiscent of a beachside Mediterranean restaurant, while the Emporium Marketplace is your go-to for all-day dining. Selections here will include sushi, made-to-order pasta, pizzas, charcuterie, and more. There's also the impressive Chef's Kitchen experience. 
bars will range from social lounges to malt whiskey bar to a European cafe to pool bars. Explorer Journeys offers unlimited beverages, fine wines, and premium spirits, including in suite mini bar, specialty coffees, teas, and soft drinks available anytime. Explorer One will also feature over 10,000 square feet of space devoted to health and wellness. This includes a luxurious spa, thermal suite, fitness facilities, an outdoor sports court, and a running track. When it comes to enrichment and entertainment, music's at the forefront with resident artists. There will also be cultural and destination-focused talks, tastings and classes, and a whole lot more. Further, these exclusive journeys provide unlimited beverages, access to a thermal suite, gratuities, and Wi-Fi. And finally, we save this Royal Caribbean ship for last, since Icon of the Seas won't technically set sail until January of 2024, at least according to the current schedule. Still, this completely new and innovative class of ship for the brand deserves a little attention this year too. After all, if you plan to sail on one of the initial Icon of the Sea voyages, you better start planning now. This once again game-changing vessel will deliver iconic family vacations. Weighing in at over 250,000 gross tons, Icon of the Seas will feature 20 total decks, 2,805 staterooms, 7 pools, 9 whirlpools, and 6 record-breaking water slides. This means that Icon of the Seas will be the largest cruise ship to date. Royal Caribbean Icon of the Seas will sail year-round, seven-night Eastern and Western Caribbean vacations from Miami. Further, every cruise will visit Perfect Day at Coco Cay in the Bahamas. Icon of the Seas will feature eight neighborhoods. Thrill Island will be home to Category 6, the largest water park at sea, with six record-breaking slides. They include some of the longest, tallest, and fastest slides in the world. This neighborhood will also feature the Crown's Edge, part Skywalk, part Ropes Course, and part Thrill Ride, along with the Lost Dunes Mini Golf, Adventure Peak Rock Climbing Wall, and a Flow Rider. The new Chill Island is a three-deck slice of paradise with multiple zones and experiences. Featuring four pools, there's a pool for every mood, each with prime ocean views bringing guests closer to the water. The vibrant swim and tonic is aligned for a swim-up bar at sea with a large pool and resting spots within the pool, while the Royal Bay Pool is the largest pool at sea with over 40,000 gallons of water in water loungers and raised whirlpools. The new Surfside neighborhood is specifically designed for families. In this neighborhood, grown-ups can soak up the endless views at Water's Edge Pool while the little ones enjoy Splashaway Bay and Baby Bay. Further, there are nearby dining options, a bar, a reimagined carousel, and an arcade. There's also the hideaway, with the first suspended infinity pool at sea, the multi-use aqua dome, and an even grander royal promenade, as well as the largest and boldest ice arena to date, Absolute Zero. Further, guests can still enjoy Central Park, the largest sweet neighborhood in the fleet, 28 different stateroom categories, and a plethora of restaurants and bars. Now, if you can't wait for some of these cruise ships to debut in 2023, then you should check out our video detailing our picks for the best cruise ships of 2022. Now, last year, the wife and I sailed a nine of the newest mega ships to debut. And in that video, we give you our honest take comparing all of these ships on categories such as best staterooms, best pizza at sea, and best entertainment. That way we can help you decide which of the best cruise ships from 2022 is right for your next cruise vacation?